Young World. So I got one more thing about this whole 3-6 Mafia bone versus before I leave it alone, probably. For me, it was a bad matchup. The show was was a good, a great show, especially on 3-6 part for me. You know what I'm saying? But overall, I think the matchup was bad because the types of music was too different. It's not really, it's not something that can really be judged by as far as like who won because it depends on what type of person you are and what, what did you come there to see. It's going to determine, like say if, say if you had Nas go against Jay-Z, that's a great matchup or Nas against Jay-Z, Jay-Z against, there's any type of Jada Kiss, you know what I'm saying? Nas, Jada Kiss, because you're going there to hear lyricism. You, you're going to sit there and be like, oh, you know it's going to be about lyrics on both sides. Who's came out hard, you know what I'm saying, stuff like that. But with Bone and 3-6, it's two totally different genres as far as I'm concerned. 3-6 Mafia, if, if you're a person that wants to be hype, you know what I'm saying, and all that type of stuff, you're automatically going to like 3-6 Mafia's um, songs better. Automatically. Because that's the type of energy it gives you. Bone is totally different. If you want to be on some laid back, you know what I'm saying, R&B, chilling smooth type stuff then you will automatically like bone better because that's what they came that's how they are they have a couple of those songs with a couple upbeat type beats a little bit hyper but overall bones whole thing is slow laid back you know what i'm saying that type of vibe so for that reason i thought it was a bad matchup because i'm a three six mafia fan you know what i'm saying hardcore three six mafia fan so automatically I knew, you know what I'm saying, as far as I'm concerned, it wasn't even a match. I'm a Bone fan too, but the type of music I like more is the 3-6 Mafia type of vibe, you know what I'm saying? And the whole thing with Busy Bone was so, like, this is why I don't like light-skinned people. And like me, myself, like I always say, I'm not above light-skinned behavior. But just from the beginning... I heard a video I seen with Busy Bone talking about DJ Paul's hand. You know what I'm saying? Talking about, are we going to get y'all devil worshiping? Because Bone was seen as the same way back then. I don't know if Busy Bone forgot. Everybody was saying Bone was devil worshippers. And if you see that Drink Champs interview with Crazy Bone. Was it Crazy Bone? Yeah, Crazy Bone I think it was. Or maybe it was Lazy. Whatever Bone was on Drink Champs. They start talking about the Illuminati and stuff like that. And just like what happened with Big Pun. I got a clip on here of Big Pun. But they started talking about Big Pun with Fat Joe. One of the champagne bottles burst out of nowhere. Same thing happened with Crazy Bone or whatever Bone was on there. They start talking about the Illuminati stuff like that. Like it started thundering. And it happened, I think, somebody started talking about Whitney Houston or somebody on there. The same thing happened then. So, so it's like some spook. But... He busy bone seems to forget that everybody was saying the same thing about. So how do you sound going out there? I'm, we gonna get y'all devil worship like, cause everybody saw y'all the same way back then, and then the whole thing with like I said attacking DJ Paul's hand. That's that's the super lame. You know what I'm saying? And then at the thing when they got into the thing, he he was like you y'all ugly mother. Who what? That don't even sound right. You know what I'm saying? Like, so that was bogus. And if I'm not mistaken. I think other people have different versions of what happened when he was like, y'all mocking me. What I seen happen, what I think happened, the mocking part he's talking about is when they was rapping and DJ Paul and Gangster Boo started like slow dancing, like opera dancing together. That's what he was talking about, the mocking, as far as what I understand, what I seen. Because he was bothered by it. And, and you're so sensitive, you get bothered by it. You had a versus battle, dude. Like And all the stuff you was talking before that, you bothered by that. That's just so weak. Then you're going to throw a bottle or a microphone and everything. The whole thing was just so, just not a good look for light skin. So I didn't like none of that. I don't have no respect for nothing Busy Bone did from the very beginning. He came out from the door way too vulgar and tacky. I mean, unless they agreed upon that. Maybe they had a meeting like, yeah, we're going to act like we really beefing. I'm going to talk about Chris, uh, DJ Paul's hand, like, which I don't think would have be part of the 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 rehearsed uh, fake stage drama, if there was one. You know what I'm saying? So he just came off way too weird from the, from the beginning for me. And then to act like that, you know what I'm saying? Like, you, you all this at stake, there's money at stake. Just, it just wasn't, you know what I'm saying? So 
And to me, of course, I'm going to sit here and say 3-6 Mafia one hands down. Because like I said, I'm more into that type of music than I am to Bone. Especially this day and even all, all the way through. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 like I said, I love some of Bone's songs, some of Bone's stuff I love. But there's some Bone stuff that I really don't like at all because it's just not my type of music. Just like with everybody else, you don't ever like everybody's stuff. But like I said, 3-6 Mafia, just the up-tempo beat, the hypeness, the energy... That alone for a person like me is automatically going to make me be feeling that more. So that's all I'm saying. I just feel like it was a bad matchup. I don't think these two groups was a good versus match. Like 3-6 Mafia should have been against somebody like Little John and the East Side Boys. You know what I'm saying? Some other type of South type of stuff. Or even like Wu-Tang Clan. It's just any, any group that's like more up-tempo, more beats or more... You know what I'm saying? Not not bone. It's just too much of an opposite thing. So I don't think that was good. I think that definitely was not a good versus matchup. The show overall was decent. Like I said, especially I love 3-6 Mafia's parts, but the overall matchup for me automatically going in wasn't wasn't working. But that's about it.